Elbit Systems of America, the American subsidiary of Elbit Systems, a global leader in defense technology, announced in August 2020 that it had secured a pivotal contract for the U.S. Army. The contract, awarded by the U.S. Defense Logistics Agency LAND, focused on supplying commander hand stations and controller for the Bradley Infantry Fighting Vehicle IFV. An article from Army Technology dated August 3, 2023, suggests that vehicles equipped with this new technology are anticipated to be delivered in July 2024. Under the indefinite delivery slash indefinite quantity ID slash IQ contract valued at a maximum of approximately $79 million, Elbit Systems of America has collaborated closely with the U.S. Army for the past three years on this project. This partnership aims to equip ground forces with the latest technological advancements, ensuring precision and lethality in critical mission scenarios. The Gunner Hand Stations, a pivotal element of this upgrade, enable accurate targeting and firing, seamlessly integrating with the Commander Hand Stations responsible for controlling the IFV's turret and initiating commands to the turret's fire control systems. Moreover, the circuit cards provided by Elbit facilitate processing and power supply to the hand station units, ensuring the seamless functionality of the system. The commander's hand station and controller are essential components within the Bradley M2A3-M3A3 vehicle, designed to streamline and enhance the vehicle commander's control over vital functions. These components serve a dual purpose, contributing to both visual surveillance and weapon engagement capabilities. Primary among these is the precise control over the rate of movement of the line of sight in the commander's independent viewer. This feature empowers the vehicle commander to adjust the speed at which their field of vision moves, allowing for optimal situational awareness and a comprehensive view of the battlefield. By offering this level of control, the commander's hand station enhances the commander's ability to swiftly and effectively assess dynamic scenarios. Beyond its role in visual surveillance, the commander's hand station and controller play a pivotal role in initiating control signals for the turret fire control systems. This crucial function enables the commander to precisely and accurately direct the vehicle's weaponry. By engaging the controller, the commander can seamlessly coordinate the aiming and firing of the vehicle's main cannon, machine guns, and other weapons. This seamless integration between the control station and turret systems ensures that the Bradley M2A3-M3A3 vehicle can accurately engage potential threats. Ronan Horowitz, President and CEO of Elbit Systems of America, expressed the company's pride in delivering vital modernization solutions to the U.S. Army. Horowitz stated, Elbit Systems of America is proud to offer critical ground vehicle modernization solutions for the U.S. Army to support accuracy and lethality for soldiers. He emphasized the significance of this achievement, highlighting the unwavering commitment to providing soldiers with the highest quality technology for mission success. Production and enhancement of gunner hand stations for various Bradley variants have been a cornerstone of Elbit America's strategy for over two decades. Ridge Sower, Vice President of Ground Combat and Precision Targeting at Elbit America underscored this extensive experience, stating, For more than 20 years, Elbit America has designed and manufactured the hand stations for Bradley variants. Mr. Sower highlighted the company's expertise in producing modular designs, promoting consistency across different vehicle platforms. He stated, The end result is a superior, rugged solution that we can produce quickly and deliver to soldiers on the battlefield. Elbit America's contributions to the Bradley family of vehicles encompass a range of vital components, including also, ruggedized tactical displays, turret processor units, and single-card turret processor units.